The list of Western alums who have become college and university presidents is certainly one marked with quality individuals. And quality is evident in the career of 1952 Western Kentucky graduate Martin Massengale. The current president of the University of Nebraska's three campus system, Massengale credits Western and its faculty with providing important opportunities for him. Western was also the window to the world for me in many ways. It provided a wide array of opportunity and exposure to numerous subject matters that would not have occurred otherwise. Also, I was exposed to many cultural and athletic activities while a student. Western provided me the opportunity to have full responsibility for teaching a course in my senior year. This experience served me well when I again had full responsibility for teaching in graduate school, and that early teaching experience has been an excellent background for my entire academic career. A leader in the field of agronomy, the Monticello native says Western Kentucky was a great place to begin a college education for him, and because of some unique qualities, remains that way. Well, the campus setting itself is unique, and it has managed to maintain a caring attitude for its students. The campus on the hill makes you look out to the rest of the world. It's a great way for a young person to begin a college education. Massengill has witnessed and been a key player in higher education and its changing picture over the last three decades, and is grateful to Mark Western as a beginning point in that career. To thank Western Kentucky University for the opportunity it offered and for opening a window to the world for a young man from a small farm near Monticello. 1992 Hall of Distinguished Alumni Honoree, Martin Massengale. Well, thank you very much, President Meredith. On an occasion like this, one hardly finds words to express how they feel. Let me say that it's a wonderful honor, and I'm deeply indebted to those who made this possible. There are many people that one should thank this evening for the help and support that they have provided. You know, attending Western Kentucky University made a tremendous difference in my life. When you think of the people here that lead and teach, it seems that they have a gift for helping young people find themselves. And I think of the great mathematician Sir Isaac Newton when he confided in a friend once that if he were able to see further than some, it's probably because he stood on the shoulders of giants. You've heard and seen many giants here this evening, but certainly among the administrators, the faculty, and the alumni of this institution, there are many. And they always seem to have time to care and share with others. Some of those were here prior to my being a student, some during the time that I was a student, and I'm sure there are others today. You know, it's a tremendous strength for this university and a wonderful heritage to have those kind of people. Let me say that if I've been able to accomplish anything in my career, that there's another group of people that deserve equal credit, and that's my family. My wife, Ruth, my children, my brothers and sister who are here this evening, and my parents. They've always been very supportive and very encouraging. They've been partners and they've been my inspiration. And let me say to those dedicated educators at Western and other places along the way, that they encouraged a young man from Monticello to believe in himself, to believe that he could do something more, that he could do something different, and maybe even do something that he hadn't thought about before. And let me say that in reality, I should be giving this honor to the university rather than the university to me. But Tom, if you don't mind, I think I'll keep it anyway. Thank you very much.